I, I had the first half. I didn't know what else Cramela, to say. Cramela. I didn't know what else to say. Cramela. It's going to be a short after show for me. What time is it actually? Uh, no, I, I, Nine. We're putting in hours. 720. 720? Wow. It's going to be a 10 minute after show for me. <gasps> it's okay. Want to open up some stuff we got from the P.O. box? Yeah. I mean, I said it all in the main show. Oh. Yeah, you got it out. I said, it's I all said been it said. Out. Well, then it yeah. is. that's it. Now we'll open up some stuff. And that's enough said. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> Who's going to grab yeah, it? Oh, Rocco's in, oh, should I? Rocco is always the one to grab it. No, I'm taking a stand. Rocco. Oh, man, taking a seat. I think it makes like sense it. That, that the crew Kevin grabs has it, so then we're it. not oh, like up Kevin. and moving around. Yeah. Yeah, like Kevin. I think it was a little ridiculous. You expected me to get that. It's breakable. This is fragile. Don't guys, toast it. toast it to me. From an independent. Oh artist. my god! Oh wow! Hey guys, if you want to send stuff to us, send it to Mega sixty four PO Box seven one three zero nine zero Santee California nine two zero seven two. Oh, I want to give a quick update. I I several people reached out. Thank you everyone who did. I've got a guitar. It's on the way to me now. So Whoa. a rock band guitar. I got an Xbox three sixty oh. rock band guitar. <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> Even better than a real one. Thank nice. you. Congrats, because that was hard to When find. I get it, I'm going to give a real shout out once I get it, and I'll play it on, you know, on air. For Rocco. <laughs> That's yeah, all I'm going to read. God damn it. <laughs> How does that always happen? Well, wait. Hold on. Let me see what this one's for. for maybe we can. For yeah, Rocco. Maybe. I feel like every week I get the thing specifically for Rocco. Yeah. For Rocco. Derek, this one, is, I think, is a neutral one. I don't know what's in here. Oh, okay. pass, it? pass that down. Oh, neutral. Send it my way. I don't know. I got one here from New York, New Whoa. York. It's a t-shirt, and I oh, I God. love it. It is a note. I don't know who made this or sent it, but it's a it's a yellow sticky note that I made years ago. Whoa! That has I remember that. The question and answers to the remember off on it. Whoa. That would be a, that's now that's a 24 hour special. Where is so, the boo? Yeah. This is like a 64 hour special. Someone scanned. Where did they get an image of my? You might have posted it at some point. Wow. Maybe I took a picture of I it. I want, that, dude. It. I want that. Shirt. That is a 64 hour special for sure. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Kevin's birthday, May 1st. Kevin, it's coming up soon. It is. Sean, June 16th. We got a while. Um, what's dude, that say? That's sick. Sean Eyestone. Got, oh, who? Someone that works at uh, Konami. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He was trying to remember someone. Dude, the down here's off shirt. Josh Collins slash Travis because they worked at Razor, but they don't. Oh, yeah. Neither do now. <laughs> Thank you. That's sick. <laughs> it's something. Okay, I have mine here. This is from. It says for Rocco. If he already has it, it's up for grabs from Picante. This is really cool. The Picante it's saga. Akira. They just released this in 4K. They, they did a 4K Blu-ray oh, of that. I'll take it. Wow. Um, Send it on back. I want to watch really it. That's really cool. Kira. Well, I mean. In fact, I, I will trade you, uh, you know, tit for tat. You give me that, and I will give you uh -oh. AirPods. What is, what is it? What the fuck? Emoji You got those again from Picante? <laughs> Why do we keep getting emoji erasers? What is this Picante erasers? you, oh, do, you do, do? do like a trade. He sent me Elibits. He sent Picante Sean and Derek getting his drink on. Erasers. And you get a 4K Blu-ray. No, I, yeah. I, uh, I want to watch Akira. I don't have to keep it, but I would like to view it. Uh, I got, for me, Sean, big fan of Half Dome Bangers. Enjoy Falcon. And it's like field notes, but look at, look at that. Oh, and it's like a, all these national parks and Whoa. little notebooks for me. That's thank dope. you. Falcon, thank you. Hell yeah. Not sure if it's Falcon Heaney, but if it is. Oh, Balloon Boy. Thank you. We have a big one right there. It's there is oh, a yeah, big, there one, is right a big there. one. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me just say on the Akira situation. Sure. I've seen Akira. I've never been the biggest fan of Akira. Oh. But it's a seminal work in the field of animation. It has <laughs> there is a regular Blu-ray and a 4K Blu-ray in here. So I think What about a shop copy that we and, all can borrow? And uh and and there's a digital code too. So either way, I think we can all divide this up. Ooh. And I do want to watch it again to see if maybe I was wrong years ago so i want to say thank you we're all going to enjoy this we're going to use this together it's getting split up yeah eh, keep it <laughs> okay <laughs> we'll do so the big dog box? okay we want to open that one yeah garrett you, you got a knife yeah right? i'll knife it you guys vamp <laughs> all right 
vamping like fucking crazy over here. <laughs> oh, vamp is what he I'm said. Always, I, I'm, ner- <laughs> I'm always nervous when it's a big box, box of box? shit. Yeah. yeah, you should look, What's Garrett. What's in the box? Yeah, look and see if it's worth it. And yeah. see, what see, if it's something? Yeah, do a, do a pre-screen. Oh, no. no. This is a bit. End the bit. <laughs> <laughs> It's safe. I saw some food products. It says fragile all over it. It does say fragile because I saw some chips. Oh. And you know, you don't want to pop your chips. So here's a, a folder. I'll oh, pass there's that right an to essay Rocco. with it? Oh, it's... What? There's okay. uh, something in here that says for everybody. Okay. Oh, God. Um, oh, God. We got looks, the package from Jigsaw, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> looks to be some uh, Tim Tams, a Man. fabulous Ooh. cookie. Ooh, there. haven't had those in a while. Too much yeah, sugar. it has been a while, but somehow it became a thing that people gave us. Yeah. And I don't know why. I understand why. We brought it up and said we liked them, and they Did couldn't we? find them anywhere. But it was almost like, hey, you guys can't get these. They're from Australia. The fucking Tim Tams. Well, they gave us like the rare ones that you yeah, would get. Yeah, there like, was a period flavors. for years where we got Tim Tams. So this is part of the the that's cool inclusion. What do you got, Rocky? Uh, yeah, they just wanted to say uh, thank you for wishing everybody in the Mega Sixty War fam and their families, uh, including Eric. A happy new we'll eat his year with pl- including Eric, but they put a rat sticker next to his name. <laughs> <laughs> a happy laugh. new year with plenty of laughs and good energy. Damn. Hope cool. you like your gifts from Cruz. Thank you, Cruz. Thank you, Cruz. Hey, we will be stockpiling uh, our kitchenette with Tim Tams, nice and multiple Ooh. bags of love hey, chips. Cruz, My favorite Cruz chips. Cruz was at Tyocon. Oh, yeah, Cruz, I remember Cruz. Cruz. Yeah. Yeah. This is a that. care package from our good friend from Arizona, yeah, Cruz. So we, he, the we're best in good chauffeur to ever drive us around. Yeah, we're in good company. We miss this boy, See, our dear friend Cruz. He remembered from Arizona that we love Tim Tams yeah. and kettle chips. And then there's more in here. There's like gifts and Whoa. stuff. Here's some stuff for Derek. Here's a book, it seems. Wow. Oh Dude, my God. this guy... Uh, we know him well. He knows oh, us shit. personally. Some, he something's knows our Something's making taste. noise. Rocco, here's something for you. Something's making noise. Sean, I see uh, this has to be for him. Mm. Yeah, here. Check that out. Oh, I can't. I, I need to. Ooh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Okay, I think the thing that was making noise in your car seems to be uh, some type of Rick and Morty uh, box of fun. I don't want to open it, but there's a button on it, and that ma- that's that. what was making noise. Yeah, I was like taking it home in my car, and uh, Kevin said this thing was it was going off, and I'm like, yeah. what the fuck is this? Oh wow. This is like Christmas. Thank you, Cruz. Yeah. Yeah. How, how nice. Know. Know. Maybe this is too much for the after show, but Rocco, you no, have three. What's the after show? It looks like three individually wrapped like glasses, you know, like a, a, a okay. collectible drinking glass. Yeah, yeah. Those are bubbled up. Cruz, you outdid yourself. Yeah, you, you very nice. Thank this you, is man. take me a long time. <laughs> I'm just letting you know. Maybe we'll very know. nice. Would you get Cruz Derek? sent some comics to me with an ominous note that says. I know you have a thing for controversy, controversy and discomfort. No, he knows me. <laughs> so I hope this hits this the hits the nail on the head. Wish you success and opportunity. And it's uh, it looks like a zine by somebody named Lickroot. Uh, another zine called Your Black Friend, which <coughs> I may already have. I'm not sure. This sounds familiar. Looks like something I picked up earlier this year. And then I'm not sure what this is, or even how to pronounce it. But thank you, Cruz. I'll review these and uh, let you know how uh, much discomfort they gave me. I got <laughs> a Padres hat. We have a color, black. That's classic. Thank you. And Spice Krispie Treats. Thank you, Cruz. Thank you very much. He's going to be sleep eating those right I'm going to be eating these in 3 a.m. Let me say you a new era sure. cap. That's beautiful. I, I seem to also have some, some artwork here. You got some art, Sean? Uh, or Rocco? Uh, yeah, I... I think I know what this is. Um, there's a note, but I think this is for these other things. But if I'm not mistaken, I think I I'm recognize pretty that. sure. I think this is artwork by Abe, who did um, Serial Experiments Lane. Oh, shit. It, is that what that looks like? Am I crazy? Yeah. It definitely does look like But it like says that. Rocco on it. So, like, I, I think they were a guest at TioCon in 2019. I remember. Wow. We, we January didn't know that 13th, year. 2019. What's that? 
Yeah, January, that was January that Tyacon would have been then. Right? Just the anniversary. Just Dude, this week. that is is that really what that is? Wow. That's crazy. Whoa. Yeah. Trash it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you need Looks a coaster fake. or something. No, Anyways, no. Anyways, uh, wrap that incredible. up with Akira and Thank give it to you. me. Thanks. Dude, I got this bitchin' heavy black, like, Ata bag? Ita bag? What do you call it? Bags that you put all your pins in the front. Mm. I don't know. But there's, like, little Ita. things in it. He's got, like, a nerve decal in here for your car. Here's, like, a Hello Kitty yeah, uh, this razor is like blade. Christmas. Wow. Yeah, it really is a Christmas. How nice. Yeah. Chris, it's a fucking... You. More art here. There's all kinds of shit. Thanks, Damn. Cruz. Yeah, got me, uh, you got, you got me, like, there's, like, a set of Disney glasses in here, too. That's really crazy. Man. Thank you very much, Cruz. Yeah, Very really appreciated. Awesome. That's really uh, awesome. That was cool. All right. Well, I think my time is up. Okay. It's, okay. Uh, Seven thirty for me. I'm gonna hit the road. You guys can continue if you like. So yeah. Christmas came late. Sure. Sure. All right. I'll continue. Good to see you, Derek. Yeah. Drive safe. Oh yeah. You guys as well. All right. Well, I'm leaving now. All right. Oh, is this what I do, Johnny? Can you like pop them out, maybe? Yeah, pop them out. <laughs> Make them walk Get away. Get them. Um, <laughs> Yeah, pop me out. Get him out of here. Ah, oh, oh. he's gone. It's that easy. <laughs> I wonder where he is. Yeah, now we can make fun of him. Yeah, now yeah, yeah now we see what we want to say about him. That guy all night. Nope. Oh, shit. Sorry, That's did awful. you hear that? What were you saying? You piece of shit. Oh I no. Was, I was just in the sound booth and I heard everything. Oh my god. Fuck. Anyways, I am leaving. I right, pop him out. What is that? You got a good. You got oh yeah, like yeah. This. Oh, you want me to snap or should he yeah, snap? snap? Okay. God. Wow. So cool. One Sean, my, you said you didn't see in game. One of my favorite parts <laughs> of the of the or, original podcast was that Sean said that Thanos snapped some guy away. Yeah. <laughs> like like when that happens in the movie, it's a universe devastating event where half of all life dies <laughs> but in Sean, Sean it's like yeah just you know the one guy, one guy, that, went away. guy get rid of this guy it's like Hawkeye's son or something just <laughs> get him out of here uh, just a guy that's who I am just a guy you know me you love me mm. would, hey would it be possible to take a couple calls yeah okay I haven't done that in a little while yeah we could do that look at me yeah 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 should I take it or who's who from the popular Rick and Morty uh, show says, look at me. No idea. Oh, oh, that's what this is. This is a box of Meek Seeks fun. Meek Seeks. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. It, it should be noted. The note that he put on that yeah. gift was the note was for smart people. Yeah, <laughs> that was, that's pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty funny. The context made it good. We play this on friend dimension. Mm. A friend mentioned coming Copyright soon. Claim. Yeah. What is the artwork that you got? I don't know. He didn't is describe it. it that's not Junji Ito. Right? I don't know if it is. If it is, it's a very who's, who's detailed sketch. It? I don't know whose it is. It's not just a quick little booth sketch. This is some time went into it. Boys don't cry. Um, should I should I take it, Johnny? Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna have to DM him. Me and Cruz are gonna have to speak on this. Okay. Sean, will you have some of these chips? Maybe they'll calm you down. Nah. How are you on eating food like uh, from other people? Nope. No. Mm -mm. I made you cookies for Christmas. Oh, that was fine. I didn't even think about it until afterwards, and then no, I thought, no, no, I wonder if he even ate them. I ate them. They were good. <laughs> I wouldn't have blamed you if you're like, hey, kids, Garrett made I cookies. I think I showed you a picture, actually, and it was the, inadvertently I was showing you that I was eating your cookies. Like... Oh, okay. Remember that? I was showing you like the board game I was playing with Beckett, and like in the background was your cookies on a plate that I was eating. I don't remember that at all. I, but when no, you brought still. those cookies to the studio, I was stuck here finishing Todd and Aaron, <laughs> yeah. like over the break, and was like, cool. And I think that was my dinner that night. I like, <laughs> you I cleared, were excited. I cleared that box, and it was like, oh man, I just had cookies for dinner. You ever have that revelation? Yeah. Yeah. Sean, you might in the middle of the night have that revelation, but yeah. candy dinner. I, I you yeah, know what? I'm really food. good. I don't eat sugar really yeah. during the day, but that yeah. is in 3 a.m. That is my, I will go anything for sugar. Yeah. Isn't that funny, uh. Sean? I'm kind of the same way. Like, don't get me wrong. I always like sweets, but during the day, I'm kind of like, I can, I can leave them. I can, you know, yeah. I don't really want them. But like late at night, 
this it's like sound, like a bowl of cereal or like a oh, yeah. some Ooh. kind of sweet thing. Sounds Your defenses really are good. lowered. Yeah, I think that's or, you know it's like yeah, my mental fortitude is lower or something. You're like mm-hmm. I earned it. I worked hard today. Yeah, or something. I'm just in that mood. It's like yeah, some sweet kind of thing or something. Um, anyway, okay, ghost ghost dev. Or can, uh, Johnny, will there be video or should I just take the audio thing? What do you think? Uh, I- Okay. Oh. Well, so right now I just see myself. So I, I see a if... yeah a backwards image of myself. Wow. That's yo weird. yo yo. Well, that's weird, Ghost. How do you do that? What am I doing? Oh, you you're doing it. It's a simulation. You did it. I'm just waving. Who's the watcher? The watcher? Or the watcher who watches him? Yep, that's the point. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's me. Okay, right, cool. Can you guys, How can, can we you help you? Me? You guys can hear me, okay? Yeah, yeah. you sound good. Who is this? Okay. this? okay, so hi, my name is August. Uh, I've called in long time call, wait, long time watcher and caller. Okay. Um, I have a story about Cliff Blazinski uh, that I just think is so funny. So my, uh, my cousin lives in Raleigh, which is where Cliffy B yeah. lives, you know, like Epic Games and everything. And he lives like right next door to him. And she, my cousin, or my aunt always texts me like, uh the weird like he does like weird stuff like i guess his his wife is always like doing weird workouts in the driveway well well i mean this is Lamborghini. their house you can't be talking yeah, you shit. Don't, you don't, 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 on their house you're watching you, you lauren do okay. workouts come to my house and see what okay. i the sh- weird shit i'm doing yeah i'm doing w- okay, way okay, weirder gets, shit than workouts it gets it gets better okay so, but just well, keep in mind worse. that so far i'm not into the story because i think you're invading someone's privacy yeah this is getting a little so invasive keep that in mind that you're on thin ice august Okay, so speaking of thin ice, my dog, my cousin's dog drowned in Cliffy B's pool. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> well, okay. Like, Do I let this? <laughs> I so, think it's. <laughs> yeah, okay. I think we're gonna... What the fuck? Derek. <laughs> oh, Derek. What you... the? Okay. So... Wait, wait, what the wait, fuck? Wait, I'm going to snap. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, there it is. Oh. Why are you bringing, why are you sharing this with people? What kind of reaction are you <laughs> expecting to elicit from a, a fucked up story like that? That's a fucking heinous. Of, yeah, I, what the I just fuck? Wanna, I just want to get the story out there. The truth needs to be told. The truth that he yeah. has a pool? No, no, what okay. truth? No, no, it, it's what not, truth? That's it's such not, a step. Hang on, Rocco. Where's, the, where's the clicker? Are you blaming uh, them? Not, I can't, this is, I can't have just, this. I don't believe a, the whipper? Didn't a, Brian a lick of what you're like saying last insane. week. I haven't been here okay, for a so call in a very long time, and I'm frankly upset we started again. <laughs> Don't believe Ghost Hose okay, dead so lies. Okay, so the dog, the dog drowned. All right, I've heard, <laughs> yeah, enough, I don't I've heard need, enough of that story. I don't, need, I don't know what the fuck. Anyways, I just had to come back here because thank, thank you for laying down the law. That was so outrageous. I hope we someone that lives next door to me goes on um like a podcast and shit talks about do? my yeah. nude workouts. That's in the what I'm saying. Like yeah. when they started talking about like next door, I'm like oh, we're in we're in dangerous waters yeah. here. Now we're getting personal. Like yeah, like if my neighbor would call a podcast and t- I mean that no, you can't do that. Yeah, I do all kinds of weird, weird workouts in my driveway or the backyard. Yeah, because you think anyone's yeah. watching you. Well, I don't care if they are. I'm lifting weights naked and shit. Yeah. Like they don't. Why don't, does that need to be reported? At, no one needs to know. I don't need to know what animal died at what celebrity's house. That's just, <laughs> yeah, that took that's a dark turn. I don't need. And I'm sure, like, if that, di- I mean, whatever. I don't believe any. That's of it. a bummer. Morning, you walk out and there's someone else's this. dead dog in your yeah, pool. Yeah, you don't want that. They don't want to be reminded. This of isn't that. real. That wasn't real. Dude, no, my carrier pigeon call. landed on Geraldo's car. You're gonna believe this story. Oh. I don't even think they live in Raleigh. They look like Florida people He's to me. The Magnum. Mm. So sad. Geraldo well, let's hope for pigeon. a better call here. From can't, wa- honestly, can't be worse. Yeah. Wine, wine dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Wine hello. Dad Already better. Hey. Hello. Hey, it's Cruz. Hey, what's oh, up? What's up, dude? <laughs> thank Howdy. you for the gifts. Hey, thank you for all the stuff. Yeah, really. Yeah, I um I was a little worried that the stuff that I got was a little bit too, you know, like from all the shit that you guys talk about. But um I hope you like them. And and by the way, Rocco, yes, that was uh that was um uh the serial experiments lane creator. I've had that for two years, I think. That's unreal. Yeah. Dude, um, he that... was doing sketches and shit too. Wow. So I, I was like, yeah, do the panda suit. Come on. 
That's oh, so cool. That's incredible because I, I seriously was uh, so bummed we didn't go to, to Tayocon that year. I know. You know, I, I, I enjoyed going all the years that we went. But, you know, it was like we had been guests for, I think, a few years in a row. It was like, okay, well, that's yeah, fine. It makes two. sense, you know, take a year off from that. But the one year it didn't go. Just, and it was, they were there. Um, uh, what was it? I think the actress who played Ritsuko was there. Yeah, um, yeah, they were there too. Uh, there was like two other guests too. That I was oh, just wow. like, oh my God, I would have killed to, to meet them. So uh, this is unbelievable. And I really can't thank you enough. Like that is unbelievable like seriously thank you that's cool yeah that's, hey as, as soon as you tweeted that i was like you know i could pop into tayo so <laughs> um yeah it just ended up doing that and i got one for myself got one for my roommate wow. that's so cool that's Who, incredible yeah. who's the artist uh in the the portrait you gifted me um that's actually was something i wanted to explain um it's my, it's something my friend did uh my best friend they live in washington now okay um and uh yeah yeah that's just that's just an inspired piece you know inspired by the cure like obviously boys don't cry i see i see um I yeah know. uh they they drew that they gave that print to me i have a bunch of prints from them and i was like oh this seems like it'd be kind of garrett's thing oh i love it what's the artist's name um they, my my friend's name uh they're currently going by uh mers but um okay yeah they they kind of flip-flop a little bit sure um but you know well just so uh, i have yeah. some understanding okay cool but again yeah. man, very very uh generous thanks man yeah no honestly i've been wanting to send out a package for a while i just uh uh yeah i mean obviously we know what year it is oh, um yeah. so uh it's been it's been a long one for sure but yeah. um you know i think a lot of good things have come from it i, I don't know about you guys but um it's been like kind of a year to just sit back and um I guess just reflect on everything and kind of just do a little bit of growth. Yeah. Um, I've receded. That's for sure. Oh, that, you got no, that. Growth, no growth here. Ooh. Yeah. 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 In fact, I shrank. Yeah. Absolutely. In every <laughs> yeah. Way. I, I was a, I was a background character for the uh, new honey. I shrunk the kids. What? Uh, no, good, Rick good Moranis wishes. Is coming back. Yeah. Oh, good yeah. good oh. wishes to Rick Moranis. For, defend Rick Moranis at all costs, guys. <laughs> yeah. Seriously. Did we? Uh, that's solved, right? Didn't they catch the? Yeah, guy? they got the guy. Yeah. yeah, they got him. They uh, they shrank that motherfucker. Okay. Um. <laughs> yeah. But anyway. Okay. Uh. But yeah. No. But thank you. We can't thank you enough for all this stuff. Seriously. Thank you so much. Yeah. Hey. I'm. I'm just glad you liked it. And um. Sean. I don't know if you saw. Um. But uh. There's a little packet in there and um there's like a bunch of movie codes oh are you serious and yeah oh god yeah oh, there's, like, there's like eight of them oh wow fuck. Huh. okay well right here voodoo i did not see <laughs> that oh yeah, dude. Uh, yeah, Come on. there's some good ones in there oh thank you so this is my jam thank you very very much that's awesome <laughs> yeah hell yeah, I did, yeah i'm glad you called because i did not the... see that yeah no i was like i was like oh god i hope sean saw this <laughs> There's like, uh, I think there's like eight or nine of them. Oh my God. Um, yeah, some of those might not be appropriate for movie club, but uh, hey, original Pet Cemetery is in there, so. Oh, hell yeah. Don't go over on that yeah. road. Oh yeah, right there. Yeah. <laughs> Hereditary, oh dude, thank you, this is sick. Yeah, yeah, I, I literally, um, actually, I just got like a bunch of movies. I just got like Mandy, I got Hereditary, I got Get Out. They were like doing a $5 Blu-ray sale on fucking amazon oh like, nice oh wow Shit. nice yeah, I so I, I just kind of there's like gone with yeah. the wind in there there's uh, was good. porky's uh, <laughs> that's um yeah nicholas cage really kind of uh puts his uh his number at like 100 on that one yeah like he's he just kind of goes nuts I, I don't know if you've seen it have you seen color uh wh what is it um the uh color out of space color out of space. Yeah, yeah 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 uh what did what did you guys think of that I I did, if it. you did see it i liked I it <clears throat> I like uh kind of, I actually watched Color Out of Space and Mandy on the same weekend. And oh they, hell yeah. They both have a very visual style, I think that's similar. But I liked yeah. it. I, I, I dug that kind of uh almost Lovecraftian kind of space alien story. Yeah. Yeah. It's good. It's 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 cool every now and then when it's not overdone. Yeah. Yeah, and I most of the time when they do Lovecraft stuff, it is so on the nose and so overdone. Yeah. This is a little a little better. Yeah. Uh yeah, that was that was a good one. I I would like uh to recommend to you Possessor. Honestly, it's it's been on my watch list for such a long time. Ever since Same. I was like, man, what's this Possessor thing about? And then they're like, oh yeah, this is this is Cronenberg's son. He directed this. I'm like, yeah. 
I'm like, oh, okay. Like, I, I didn't even know that he had honestly directed anything. Maybe that's just me, me out either. of the loop, but... um. No, people told yeah. me about it for about six months, and then I finally, like, I, I heard it, like, from three people in one day, and I was like, I should... Okay, I'll watch it. And it was good. Yeah. Yeah, the plot... When I looked at the cover and I looked at the plot, I was like, this is not what I thought it was going to be about at all. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm I'm interested to watch that, and it's uh, it's good to hear another person recommending it because uh, well, I've I've been looking for an excuse. Awesome. Well, thank you for calling in, and, and yeah, like I yeah, said, yeah, and thank you for the package, and I'm entering my codes right now, so thank you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, please do. Can't um, wait to see you when this is all back to normal in Arizona, man. Yeah, dude. Dude, I'm I'm waiting for it. I'm. I, I, well, I heard everything I, already man, is back to normal in Arizona. It has been for a while. Uh -huh. Oh, Arizona's Arizona. good. <laughs> so we need yeah, to get you know, I, I haven't, I haven't worn a mask for like three months. So you know, it's, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, 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 it's all over. fine now. Yeah, cool. no. <laughs> all right. Um, but yeah, uh, I hope you guys really enjoyed your gifts, Derek. Uh, let me know what you think about that stuff. I don't know if you're familiar with Ben Passmore, but I really hope you like those. Um, Rocco. Uh, I hope you like your gifts. And Sean, yeah. uh, enjoy. Garrett, Thank nice you. to see you again. Thank you. Uh, Thanks very much. Yeah. Have a good one, dude. Awesome. See you around. Thanks yeah. again. Later, guys. Take care. Yeah. Oh, he's he's out. Kevin, and I'm can gone you turn too. it down? I'm slightly. leaving now for real. Okay. You can click me out. You can okay. click me off. He's officially clicked you can off. Click off. I can click <laughs> off into the sun. What is that? Is that is that a? It's DBZ. You guys were you guys you guys were in the video. Car thing. I don't drive an instant transmission, bro. He learned it on the planet with the not the Tuffles. Was it the Tuffles? No, could have been. You got Rocco babbling about Star Trek or something. He goes on that planet where they teach him how to do the. I can't take it anymore. I just want to die. That's yeah. That sums it up. Did you get me out of here? Fuck okay. yeah. I'm out. <laughs> He's out. I'm out. He's gone. Bitch. I'm fucking done, dude. Totally yeah, out. I'm fucking gone. Fuck this joint. <clears throat> I'm, I'm over It this looks like shit. he's gone. Yeah, I don't even see him. He's not here anymore. I'm so Damn. out. Um, what was Cruz's name? Wine the mic's Dad? off. Good. I could say all the fucking shit I want to No, no. Oh, my God. I can hear him. Motherfucker's dying. No, I can't hear it. Say what whatever is, you want. What is that? This dude. They're in feedback or something. Ass is so far Radio. up his own head. He's fucking Johnny, can you pot that down? We're getting shits. bleed through. What? Johnny, you gonna fix it? He's practically jerking it back in. Fuck, fuck this joint. I'm out. I don't know what that was. I'm gonna try to take a call, but Discord's like making noises or something. I don't know. Damn, this picture's from oh. 2018. Of all of yeah. us with Cruz. That was the last one we did. Yeah. Remember, I drove out to Arizona. That was <laughs> fun. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Who was? What was that? What was that? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Fucked up, yo. I miss, I miss Cruz. Let's talk to <laughs> Silkum, Silkamarsh. No, I see us many times. Silkamarsh. Ah. Can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> yeah, I heard that is, you. That, yeah, believe me, that's you. I don't know. What hey, I got meant, a but... about a cute feet. You you what? You have cute feet? What did he say? I didn't get the last part. Oh, I've got a good story about Cliffy B. Oh, <laughs> oh get out of <laughs> here! Sean wants to hear it. Go I'm ahead. gonna get mad again. If someone so went on a podcast and real? started talking about like the things Jenny did outside, whether it's like. <laughs> I would be really fucking pissed. That's so rude. Hey, weird workouts is like very low on the, I saw you doing something in your drive. No, I know. Yeah. That's the thing is too. Workout it's like a sure. workout outside. Yeah. Okay. Like, and what what's the? weird to him? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yoga. I don't know. Like what the fuck? Yeah. I don't know. He never see August. Never seen Pilates before. What, what happened to you, Silk? Well, I had a, uh, my neighbor had a dog. Oh, no, Jesus. God. I don't want to jump the fence. Get, oh, right. Jesus. Right. Well, so right. I haven't been here for Click calls in a long time. Yeah. Besides Cruz, what's the point of this? Yeah, I'm starting to wonder. <laughs> I think Rocco's rule that he couldn't pass kicked in. What's yeah. the rule? Right? Yep. When they start good, 
They're good. We have a night of good calls, and when they start bad, they don't get better. <laughs> nope. I, I think that's a rule, I mean, right? A I was right. I'm glad we took a call just so we talked to Cruz again. I think yeah. maybe from now on, that should be the rule. We take one, and if that goes if north, sucks, north or it. south, you know that, it ain't get that better. determines. Yeah. Right. I think you're right. You get bits and goof balls. Yeah, bits, bits and boops. Yeah. Beeping, speaking. Uh, <laughs> my, cat, beeping. my cat went oh, to Raleigh. Oh, hi. Can you hear me? Yeah, do you have any animals that live in Raleigh, North Carolina? Uh, no, I do not. You All see right. anything happen in the okay, driveway? You can, you can continue. Then. Okay. Uh, well, real quick, I did actually have a dog experience when he came home the other day. Uh, started chasing me down the driveway, but that's not, that's a... not what I came to call about. No. Oh, okay. Okay. Did okay. You get away. We'll leave, it, leave it there. No. <laughs> yeah. The dog's still attached. <laughs> um. Just so I'm gonna put you on the shit. spot. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what's the progress with the book? Oh. oh. Uh, ch- go to Barnes and Noble, check out <laughs> bestsellers, and see if you can find it. No, we're work- I mean we're still working on it. We're uh, still yeah, all the text taste. is there. It's pretty much it's just still being edited by someone. Yeah, but it, it's out of my hands currently. In the editor's hands. In the editor's hands, who is working on it? Uh, very nice guy. He's working on it, and yeah, I think it w- it will come out. You will read it. Do you think it? you'll get someone to narrate it? Uh, audio yeah. book. Uh, we, yeah. Morgan we should Freeman. do it ourselves if we do the audio version. Nah. Nah. Everyone always says. Nah, I listen to they call me Baba Booey, and it's and by him. It is by him, and that's what you want. Yeah, I guess you don't want some British voice doing like your I narrative. Do. That's not no. Good. I do fitting. No, I want Richard Attenborough. Is he alive? Which Richard, one of them, David and Richard. I don't know which one's the. Are all the Attenborough one. boys dead? <laughs> which one's the Welcome to Jurassic Park? One? He's dead. David's David alive. David's alive. We okay. have a. We have, a, we have the British uh, expert. We have an expert. <laughs> David is <laughs> um, alive. <laughs> would you rather digest the book uh, as a, like a physical form, or would you would you like some kind of like streaming audiobook version? I think I'd be more upset. If I didn't have a physical version, sure. But an audio version would be really nice to have. If I could just listen to it in the background. A companion piece. Yeah, because you know I yeah. only will read a book if there's pictures. So that's I'm, I. I'm it's crossing all, my fingers. Pictures. Oh, okay. Then I'll read. It. I'm really into audio books myself. That is my thing. But so you if like, you ever hear me say I read a book, know that I did not read it and I listened to the sure. book. But you can't say I listened to a book. It's, it's not like an idiot. So just know in the future if I say, oh, I read that book, I didn't. And I listened to sure. it. Sure. That's that's acceptable now. Ten years ago, it was debatable, but now it's, mm-hmm. it's acceptable. Now, do you think that you should be doing your own audiobook? Like, do you like listening to people who recorded their own audiobook, or do you like listening to a professional voice actor? I listened to David Spade's audiobook. Yeah, and he did it and himself. And here yeah. is the thing. Is oh, God. I, most of the time, I liked it. <laughs> But every now and then, he'd give me a little extra flair, which you think, oh, good. That's what you want. No, it's not what I wanted. Because he would say something, and he'd go, ha-ha, Joe Dirt. And it's like, mm, Too much. I don't need that. I just want to hear about how you wrote this thing with Chris Farley. So, you know. Kelsey Grammer has an autobiography on uh, cassette tape that what? we have from, like, the back in the 90s. Oh, And wow. it's really interesting. It doesn't have a book, but I actually... Don't think I would be entertained watching a book, but the way he describes his entire life oh. up, up until the 90s, it's I, actually really interesting. I got an, hmm. Now, here's the thing is I am a Kelsey Grammer nut over here. Jeez. Fuck off. He <laughs> loves he his wife. He's here for the live show, and here I am talking in the live show. So no. how about you shut the fuck up no, I and look never, at her anime picture? never thought that. So what? Go ahead. No, I just never thought someone would call themselves a Kelsey Grammer nut. <laughs> but, no, I just never it's, thought it's, I, I never thought I heard that sentence. It's complicated because <laughs> Jenny and I to fall asleep, watch Cheers all the way through until we finish that. And then we start Frasier, watch Frasier all the way through until we finish that and go back to Cheers because it's been like six months at that point. It's complicated. Uh, it's co- anyways, the point <laughs> is we don't like Kelsey Grammer. Oh. I don't wait, like him, wait, but you're a wait, nut. You, I think you said you're a nut. I'm so confused. I mean, he has a crazy <laughs> life. <laughs> I don't like him. I like the shows he happens to be on and maybe okay, starring. Okay, but everyone gives me shit when I say I don't like it. I enjoy watching it. 
Uh-huh. That doesn't make sense, but I, I'm a Kelsey Grammer nut. I hate him. <laughs> <laughs> it makes sense. How does that even remotely add up? I just don't. I just feel like he's so fucking into himself. Yeah. I, and yeah. whenever there's an episode Frasier. of Frasier about yeah, Frasier. You're a Frasier Crane nut. And I'm a, yeah. You're not a Kelsey Grammer nut. You're a Frasier Crane I'm nut. I'm a Frasier Crane nut. Listen, sure. I'm the only one who has seen Kelsey Grammer in person at Disneyland. Oh. Not when he fell stage. off the stage. Was Camille with him? No, he was. He had like three kids. Like he was trying to get into the stroller or something. Oh wow! Wow, that sounds like a on Main pain Street. And he yeah. just looked Been like there. he was having a shit day. Been there, Kelsey. <laughs> yeah, I was That's eating breakfast stuff. and I was just watching Kelsey Grammer struggle with his bags and stuff. I was just like, "What is this?" But I didn't help him. Yeah. Well, because I didn't want him to go beast on me. We <laughs> know those shows so hey, well that he was the best beast. He was. No yeah, one, he no was. one was better cast than Beast. Agreed. True. And when that casting was announced, every person on the planet was like, "Perfect." That was, yeah. uh, no I would say, upset. Patrick Stewart as as Professor X yep. and yep. Beast uh, being Kelsey Grammer yep. were the two absolute best casting. Well done. And it's a shame it was wasted on X Men Three. Yeah, it is true. Yeah. 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 Anyway. Anyways, so yeah, I would be interested in listening to his book. And see what he has to say. Maybe I'll turn a, co- a corner. And maybe I'll like him, but <laughs> I don't think so. Yeah. So no. To answer your question, we don't want Kelsey Grammer to narrate our book. No thanks. Oh damn. Okay. Well, I, this is the first time hearing that Kelsey Grammer was Beast. That's actually mind blowing. Yeah. So. It's oh, perfect, yeah. right? Yeah, I'm looking at it. And it's incredibly good. Yeah, yeah. It's great. Yeah. Are you going to tell us now about how Beast drowned in the pool or what? Can you tell us what Beast's first name no, is? No, I'm, I'm all set. Beast? I did have a question for Derek. I'm sorry, what was your question? Go ahead. Uh, I'll answer it. Derek? Well, Derek's not here. I have a question for you. Wait, wait, wait. Garrett, one second. Okay, he's not here. Just checking. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, yeah, he damn. could be sneaking around and hiding. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, what was, was Beast's name Hank? Yeah. Hank, yeah. Hank Beast? Hank, wasn't it Hank Jordan? I don't know the last. Uh, I can't I'm not sure the last name, but Hank. yeah, I think it was Hank Jordan. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was. I think it was Hank Jordan was Beast. Hank Jordan. Yeah. Johnny got a com- confirmation on that. Hank Jordan and uh, what was Professor Xavier's first name? Xavier. Uh, Charles. Charles Xavier. Yeah, Charles. <laughs> Xavier Xavier. It's like the Mario <laughs> Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Is it Hank? Hank McCoy, McCoy, that's it. What's Hank Jordan then? That, I, Look that up Hank Jordan. That didn't ring a bell. You think of Hal either. Jordan. Who's Hank Jordan? No one. Uh, a professor at Rosemont College. No. Yes. Shut. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you would. Oh, that, that was. It is. Wait, you guys. Uh, had, it is. <laughs> you guys had that dude. That was a oh, teacher. Mr. No. That was a teacher. <laughs> We all went to that <laughs> shitty college. Uh, he Googled it. It was that. <laughs> he was a teacher. <laughs> you crossed. He was a teacher. Hey, Hank was a, a professor in the X-Men. Yeah, and, yeah. So oh, I was not that far off. Close. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. Well, I remember him because I wanted to cast him in uh, Mega 64 a long time ago. I actually thought he would be. He was such a personality Hank oh. that when there was, there was one episode or at some point we wanted to cast a detective. And it was like, yo, that guy could do it. That guy could absolutely do it. But then, like, he fell off the face of the earth. Oh, my God. So, I don't know if he's alive. That's Johnny found him. Yeah. So fucking Johnny funny. <laughs> so, uh, Beepin, you had some kind of question for Derek, but he's not here. So, yeah. Anything else? Yeah, I'm all set then. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. That's Fair enough. Later. All right. Have a good one. Thanks Bye. for watching. Beepin. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go after this call. No, you'll stick around. I won't. That's the crazy Quick thing shake. about it. Maybe we'll do it together, Sean. Okay. Quick shake. Like we do everything together. Hello. Quick shake. Hey, quick. I see. What's going on? Here? What? I saw a small dog in the Wait. background. No, no, no. It's not you. Hello. This is what I was like on that podcast. Dot cops. I couldn't say anything. They couldn't hear me. There was a dog running around in the background for a yeah. while. Quick I, shake. We'll, we'll, I want to see that dog. No, again. we can't hear you. I'm sorry. But hello. We'll come back to you. Fix your fix your stuff, and I'm we'll not, come back. I'm not going to come day. back to you. Uh, let's talk to Slicey. There was a dog running around in the background. Slicey. Quick shake. 
Slicey's listening to us try to speak with uh, quick shakes. Plates versus shakes. Who would win? (laughs) Yeah, shakes versus plates. I forgot about that. Hello, Slicey. In uh, Warwick Davis' career. Yeah, everyone at home, go look up Hello. shakes versus plates. <laughs> final, it's like final battle or oh, something. That guy. is a that's fight in a movie that makes me laugh Always. every time, and I don't know why. It's like the saddest it's, moment. I don't, I don't have the context of the rest of the movie, <laughs> and I don't ever want it. No, I, I will not watch the movie. People are like, oh, but it's actually pretty good. Don't I? I just want the fight on that its own. Sci-fi channel where this, original. Is where not for very some good. reason Warwick Davis is pulling plates out of the ground and throwing them at a poor old man. <laughs> I don't need the context. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> Slice, Slicey, what's up? Uh, yeah. Slicey. God damn. Sean's okay, having we're a hanging blast. up on Slicey. We're going to talk to... Sean's having a ball and a biscuit, baby. Sean, who do you want to talk to? Maybe Dingus Khan. I can't hey, how's it going, guys? Hey, hey, what's up, hey, Dingus Khan? Hey. Oh, it's great, man. You know, Jama Sunday, how are you guys doing? Oh, yeah. Feeling good. The Sunday's Feeling almost over. Right? Yeah. Um, I got a question for you. Um, so I want to know about times you bullshitted your way out of a bad situation. Because you do a lot of stuff in public, right? Yeah. True. Yeah. Bullshitted my way out of a bad situation. I mean, I, I'll speak for somebody else and I'll say, Sean telling people when we were filming stuff, they would ask, what are you doing? Why are you filming here? You're not supposed to be here. And Sean would just go, well, you know, we're just doing a little Halloween come early. <laughs> and they would always go, oh, oh, okay, that is next month. Well, okay. Um, yeah. That's School a cute project. one that I remember. But um, bullshit in a way out of a situation. Um, uh, I think I've told this story, but the one that comes to mind is uh, when we needed to film with Gabe Newell in a very specific spot outside of... Uh, the uh moscone center in san francisco yeah we we wanted to film in the same spot where we filmed with miyamoto and had to be the same spot it had to be the same spot and we got there with gabe newell and they used that they roped off that whole area for a catering team to set up Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and i just went into autopilot like I don't even know. It was like something went off in my brain. Like you need to get all these people out of here right now. So you can do this video. And I just started acting like I was in charge. And I was, I was going to this catering team. Like guys, you got to wrap this up. It's done. Everything's ready. Just get it out of here. Just get it out. And they, I didn't even think that I was, I wasn't like, I guess trying to bullshit. I was just saying those things. And I was dressed up kind of nice because I was, I I was, we were in the Beatles. Yeah. Yeah. For the video. Yeah. And I think they thought I was staff or something. And they just went with it like, oh, 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 yeah. Let's get the sandwiches out. Let's move them out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, I, and then I just started going with it. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, guys. Yeah, another area. Another area. Another area. Yeah, just bring the coffee around there. Yeah, dude. And it was like, I don't know where I sent those guys. <laughs> they don't know either. But it was like, we've got Gabe Newell here, who, who, as far as I know, isn't acting in many skits with other people. Right. And, and we have for this to not them. work, I can't afford to let that happen. I'll I'll get in trouble later. Just you know, so I sure. I kind of acted like I was managing the catering team for a minute, just to yeah. get them out. Um, and uh, but that's that's the main that's the big one I can think of. Yeah, uh, um, another one I can think of we've already mentioned on the podcast as well was when that guy wanted me to pay four hundred dollars to get my boxes back at Pax East. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and I refused to let that happen and i just yeah you know but that wasn't like bullshitting i was more just like i think i bullied him out of that yeah that wasn't bullshitting that was that was just stone cold intimidation i was like i i i dare you to charge me four hundred dollars for yeah. getting this did you handle it did yeah you touch sure, it? there's a four hundred dollar handling fee so, oh handling fee who handled it you handled it i'd like to know who handled it <laughs> just give me a list of the names of the people who handled it because as far as i know they just set the box down there by the door so i don't think anybody handled it did you handle it sir I, i'm i'm just doing my my job on, on on this okay so i can just pick it up and walk away and then that's it we don't have to do the handling fee that's a good that's a that's a good point you can just uh, <laughs> take it, and walk. it okay and, and that saved us 400 bucks it did save us 400 dollars, and that guy literally didn't do anything they dropped a box off in his little place of business he didn't touch it and they, 30 seconds later i went to go get it yeah he said you owe me 400 dollars. we like, really I, <laughs> we we didn't inconvenience the guy at all they set a box by the door and we went and picked it up. 
And he didn't even hold it. I mean, I'm yeah, serious. No, no, one, no one did any work or anything like that. It was just, oh, I need to charge you because they set it down. It was there. in his little room yeah. for, I'm not exaggerating, three minutes. Yeah. And it's like, there's no way I'm paying you $400. I'm yeah. not going to do that. It was like, oh, Never. I'll, just, I'll just walk away and forget you saw me. Okay. <laughs> that yeah. was... But they are, that wasn't like bullshitting. Yeah, that wasn't. But there yeah. are so many times that I've talked to people about what we're doing or, you know, someone's been upset with us and you just kind of, just if you talk nicely yeah. and then have a little bit of nonsense thrown in there, like the things that they, like Halloween come early, like, yeah. I don't really know what you're saying, but you seem nice about it. So I yeah. guess I'll let I'll move on. Oh, Sean, the best one, I, I'll, I'll speak for you because, yeah. you know, that one, it really wasn't bullshit. I'll tell you the your best bullshit okay. is when we were filming around, uh, I mean, it's it's going to be gone any moment now. Yeah. The big stadium <laughs> here in San Diego, yeah. the stadium that the Chargers used to play at, sure. we filmed there. We wanted locate, uh, you know, for our, I think it was our Madden 2018 video or whatever. Yeah. And we uh, filmed at the stadium and then security was on the prowl looking for like Sean was running around the studio, uh, the, the stadium. They wanted to <laughs> like get him. The parking and so lot. They found us and then pulled up and Sean immediately went, oh, thank God I found you. <laughs> oh, thank God you're here. You've I've been, been trying to. The whole time. Yeah, I've been trying to find you all day. I wanted to know if we could <laughs> film around here. <laughs> Oh, no, sir, you can't. Oh, well, golly, I'm glad you told me that because I was about to shoot. <laughs> and got in the car. It's like we got we filmed everything. Yeah, we got everything we needed. But, but Sean's plan was when the guy showed up to say, oh, thank God you arrived. We've been trying to it find worked. you. We weren't in trouble. Yeah. And the guy, I mean, so he, good. he was he was nice with us. He was just like, oh, no. Yeah, actually, you, you I mean, you should stop. Or you shouldn't we, do it. Oh, okay. Real we talk. Won't. There's a shot of me coming out from the tunnel in that Madden video. Yeah. I walked all the way to the field. I was yeah. in the middle of the stadium on the field. Yeah. But the whole time, I was going, I'm looking for security. Yeah. Sean Is was security yelling there? that. Where's security? Excuse me. Just the football player. <laughs> Just the, fo <laughs> <laughs> the football player holding a camera, thinking like, whatever I get, I'm going to say like, yeah, I'm glad I found you. Yeah. Can I do this? Oh no. Okay, I'll go. Thanks a lot. So. Yeah. I yeah. I was probably one of the last people on the field of that fucking stadium. Yeah. Honestly, you probably <laughs> were. But yeah. Anyway. Anyways. That's the key. Is just ask for security. It'd so then, nice. if security comes, you could just go. Oh, you're here. Oh, thank God. You're I wanted here. you to be here. Anyway. I wanted this to happen. Anyways. That was a good call, Dingus. That was. Yeah. Good thank call. You, Dingus. Oh, thank you. Thank you guys for taking my call, man. I thank really you. appreciate Ding it. No, Dingus, oh. you don't have a dog, right? No, no dog stories, oh, okay. no, no drowning dog stories. I don't okay, uh, spy on anyone's neighbors. I don't do that shit. You don't, you don't. Hey, Dingus gets it. Dingus, you don't play Lawbreakers, do you? No, no, I don't okay. do that. Right. Um, oh, also, uh, Garrett, we met at Anime Expo, oh, and I want to say you were... Yes, I'm the dude with the FLCL tattoos. Um, I don't know if you okay. remember I was the hoping Adam was Sandler say FLCL treatment. Shirt. Yeah. Like, oh. Well, that doesn't narrow it down. I don't remember right off the top of my head. Uh, last time I was at Anime Expo was a year ago. So, um, I, 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 I'm really sorry. I think I came on a, a bit too strong because I told you to give me a little bit of the Adam Sandler treatment when we met up. Mm. No. Oh, what? yeah. And, and Garrett was like, oh, what do do? Yeah. I, remember I was that. probably like, oh, no. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. I remember that <laughs> telling that story. What was that? What was it's it? all good. Something yeah. fall? Was that you? No. I Sean, I think you're. you're Chair kind of broke a little bit. Oh yeah, those chairs. Dude, I've, the I've, snacks. I've gone through those it's chairs. Those, it's those snacks, man. Those the snacks, snacks I've been eating. Sean's chair just broke. Yeah, it didn't really. <laughs> that's what it sounded like. Oh no, I was sitting it incorrectly, so that probably didn't help. Sean, I, I sat in one of those chairs in the other room while we were planning something. I just went through it. Oh man, <laughs> like it, like it, comedically, it turned, it turned to pieces under my ass. I. Those cheap. Those chairs are cheap. I was about to say those cheap. Yeah, here I'm gonna show the chair. You can't see it oh. now. Yeah, turn. Oh, yeah. yeah, turn it off. Oh, you're gonna ruin the pop. illusion. The, you guys, you're not gonna believe this. I'm really on this couch. I was just gonna. I can put it on that side. Oh, okay. Dingus, the chairs are very. Yeah, very these are at IKEA for about three dollars. Like, yeah, 
thin yeah, plastic aluminum. Bad. Yeah. I why, was... why are you treating Sean so badly? Why can't you get him a nicer chair? Hey, he's, he painted that <laughs> he, chair. He made that. He could have painted any chair he wanted, and I he did. took the $3 he, chair but in there. the most uncomfortable why? chair in the entire but store. But my <laughs> thought was, I'm going to, we have a lot of these chairs around the office for, you know, various reasons. Yeah. yeah. I'll paint this one, and I'll fit on the couch. Like, Derek having his nice chair works. Yeah. But if I have this little chair, I it, fit right on the couch with Garrett. It yeah. does vanish under you. It does work That's well. true. It works great. Yeah, and it, it I, was I, the chair. I, I snapped this back part. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not fake. Hey, guess what? Get what that, that was, that real. was, that, that was that, real. That was all real. But yeah, the back <laughs> part snapped. So I was sitting in yeah, it. Yeah, it snaps all right. So You're I, just <laughs> knocking it. Well, yeah, so <laughs> when we were doing the Halloween, the haunted house, Ah. Uh, before it had started, we were sitting there eating burritos and, and talking about like, okay, how how are they going to film this and how are they going to end that chair? As I was eating the burrito, that chair disintegrated under me. I just went through it straight <laughs> to the ground, and it was like, yeah, you hurt? Need to eat, maybe eat a few less burritos. What's that? <laughs> you hurt yourself doing that? Uh, yeah, I mean, it, my ass got pinched. Uh, yeah, pinch mm. your bum. It's kind of like that uh, scene in The Sopranos where Vito sits on the chair. <laughs> Uh, those no, were I plastic. Know. I don't remember that there. particular scene, but I believe it happened. Well, those I think I don't chairs. think that's what happens to Vito. I think it's much worse. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, you see what he's doing in that truck. Yeah. Um, no, that Dingus. was good. That was a nice yeah. thing. Oh yeah, that was nice. Uh, so you've got some fully coolie tattoos. I hope to see them again next Anime Expo. We'll have to recap. Yeah, dude. Uh, I can't wait to, uh, you know, I have to go back to normal and uh, yeah. gather up and get. What were we like, doing? Were we showing off? Were we like, yo, look at this. This is unit one here. No, I actually, like, I was oh, like, Haru. <laughs> I was looking at the stuff at the booth and you were like, yo, dude, those are like, uh, that's like the whole FLCL town and stuff. And I was like, yeah, that's like. Oh, the, yeah, the, the big whole... iron. Yes, exactly. I remember it now. Me. See, uh... once we start describing the visualize, mm -hmm. you know. I only have tattoos yeah. from the new FLC. Yeah, fully cool <laughs> he got he got progressive and alternative. Yeah. Oh God. I like to go obscure. <laughs> that's, I still haven't seen it, and that's I don't know, everyone's response. I don't know a human that's watched it. I know several it, that have, I, and I that's the response it. that it's oh. terrible. I saw all of it, and it's it's so it's such a fucking money grab, and it's so bad. <laughs> it, and like I've seen people online trying to make excuses for it as well, and you're like, what are you doing? It's so funny because I remember the Anime Expo panel where they announced yeah. it. Hey. We are doing a sequel to Fooly Cooly. And I remember everyone around going, oh, don't do that. Mm -hmm. Please don't do that. It doesn't need it. Don't do it. And they were like, no, trust us. It, trust yeah. us on this. You got six episodes. And guess what? Came out. No one watched it. No one cared about it. No one wanted it to exist. Yeah. Still don't. <laughs> it's like, yep, this is exactly what we told you. If the six episode <laughs> thing was perfect, don't yeah. make more. Don't make 12. Especially it's like with that show where it was only six and that's yeah. all you needed. And Statement made. I would even go like, all right, maybe years down the road, like, hey, let's do a sequel, another six. Mm -hmm. But they went and said, no, we're doing two sequels. Two giant new shows. Here's two I'm seasons good. of each. Uh, That's like, yo, we're doing Lord of the Rings trilogy two. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but much. there's going to be 12, new, 12 movies. Well, I mean, Shit. I mean, honestly, like Star Wars, they announce like 20 movies at a time, and it's like, chill out, chill out. Just announce one. I can't get excited because it's too much to look at. Sean, Here, you here's love 23 logos. Yes. You know? Sean, you would love Fully Cooly because it's, yeah. it's in a place of my, in my heart that is close to Ava, oh, but good. it has nothing to do with the stuff that you don't like from Ava, and there's baseball in it. Oh. So. And it's six episodes. You got to swing oh, that no. bat. Well. Yeah, it's six episodes noncommittal. You got to swing that bat, Sean. Okay. I, yeah. You, yeah. He would like it, right, Dingus? I, I think so. I think what's really special about um, Furi Kuri and, like, a, like, I think this is, like, a statement about really great media is that you come back to it a few years later and you can interpret it differently. Ah. And I think that's what makes it so good. I, I really am not sure if anime is for me. <laughs> I watched Ghost in the Shell. I won't talk about it here because we did it for Movie Club. I'll oh, save you it. watched the the original animation? Yeah, ninety seven. I watched it on movie? DVD. Oh wow, yeah, I got some the good original manga. U.S. manga. DVD. Yeah, yeah I got that. that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, you could try checking out sports animes. Yeah, I don't, yeah. that's an upcoming Movie Club. I can't wait. That's coming to Movie Club. I can't next wait. Week, I think. Uh, no. The, the next are we year? way ahead and i just uh, let the camera yeah, back I think, we're way, I think we might be way ahead but you, I, I can't remember well it's gonna eventually it's coming up yeah 
Uh, sorry. You like Bato or Makoto? Or are you Saito kind of guy? Who are you yeah. into? Yeah. Well, we'll find out. You gotta <laughs> sub, sub to us on Patreon and we'll find out my favorite. Okay. <laughs> Maybe he's into... I bet... Hey, Dingus, he's into the Tachikomas. I bet he is. He is. Uh, They're so Sean, cute. I'll be honest with you, I have no idea what that means either. Mm-hmm. All right. Hang up on this guy, uh, Johnny. <laughs> I got the, thanks I got the, the call, person. guys. Oh, thanks, thanks Dingus. Take it Thank easy. you, Dingus. I think it's a good last one. Yeah. No, I'm keep going. Oh, Are you really? <laughs> yeah, of course. Johnny, uh, instant transmission me out, please. I got the mouse. Yeah, well, also I'm Garrett waiting, Johnny. <laughs> I- IRL. He's there, IRL. Garrett's a lot harder to get out of there. See, you talked about tattoos for 20 minutes. Get, let me. Uh, okay, give let's, me a call. Okay, let's see. C- CD ROM. Oh, I get Hi. it. CD ROM. Oh. oh, it's cool. I like your name. Yeah, I, right. Thank I can't you. barely Thank read, you. so I just thought it said CD ROM. Yeah. I can't well, read. That's shit, good, I guess. Shit. Yeah. Um, so, hi, I'm uh, Nicole from the New York show. Oh, hey, how's Hello. it going? Hey, Nicole. Good. How are you guys? Yeah, What's up? Good. Isn't that, a, that crazy? That was a year ago. That's crazy. I that, can't believe it all happened the same year. I was, can't believe it. <laughs> that makes me so sad. And then that was like a year ago and a week or two. Yeah. And then today was the opening of Rise of the Resistance. Wow. And that was a year, you know, it's like, and only days later, we all went on it. Remember? I know. For Kevin's and, bachelor And that party, was yeah. all a year ago, too. Oh. Uh, I think back to the That's year that cool. we could have had, like, the year was supposed to be another full, like, tour, and yeah. probably many more after, like, yeah. and, and we got the one in the beginning. It and, is such a fucking bummer. I just remember yeah. ending that New York show feeling so good. Like oh, cloud nine. Okay. Oh, yeah. We're going to keep doing this. Well, here's yeah. the thing is we, I felt good after every show, yeah. but we sold out that New York show and yeah. I felt like we killed it and like everyone loved it. And then we walked We out. realize we're speaking for you though. So we, you know, we're yeah, not gonna... maybe you didn't like it, but I, but I felt it. so I good it. about it. And I was like, dude, that was like a life changing event that we just like, I can't believe that. Like we sold yeah. out a place in New York and yeah. And they liked it. Like that was, Oh yeah. So much fun. Although, although I have, I know we talked about this at one point, but that New York show was a little weird because again, it, it was the fastest sellout of all of them. Yeah. And we wanted to add more shows because of that, but it would just didn't work out. And, and because it was right after the holidays, it was a weird time yeah. to book all yeah. that. But, um, but that night was weird because it was an instant sellout. It was like one of our most fun shows. But that venue like wanted us out as fast as possible so they could do like an improv. Yeah, they yeah. did. Yeah. yeah. So it was like, cool. Glad everyone liked that. Get out. Out, out, out. Don't talk to them after the show. Go. <laughs> yeah. And then they had like yes. an improv show where there were like two people where it was like they were just like dirt doing like limericks and stuff. And it was like, what? You had a sold out show and you kicked us out. Like what? I didn't. Un- I could not understand that setup. That yeah. was the only but, like uh, sleazy owners meeting where maybe. they where they were like, "Hey guys, glad you came to our comedy club." And we don't have to worry; that place is out out of business. Are they? Oh yeah, during no, COVID. Uh, oh yeah. Are you? Sh- oh, they are. Sure. are they? I pretty sure. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Used to be USB. Used to be USB. U- UCBs. <laughs> yeah. UC- <laughs> USB. UCB. Um, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if that place is no longer around. But that we we had a weird slimy handshake in the green room afterwards. Thanks for coming to our club, guys. Oh yeah. <laughs> Make sure to plug the improv troupe afterwards if you know what I mean. And it was like, okay, yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, I don't know. That was the that was the only place that we didn't have like a th- meet and greet. We, afterwards. Yeah, we didn't like stay a long a long. But time we're after. speaking for you. Anyway. Sorry. <laughs> no, you're good. Um, no, I did feel like um, it was a rush against the clock to meet everyone at the end, but it yeah. was fun. Um, the friend I brought wasn't as uh, isn't really as big of a Mega sixty four fan um, as me, but really enjoyed it even without like the context of awesome. the videos. That's, that's, cool. that's how good the show was. Yeah, they really really enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I just wanted to call to say hi, and um, yeah, I was hoping to go to uh, game days last year. Uh, for my second time ever, but yeah, things happen. Damn, it's gonna eventually, yeah. you know. The next game days is just gonna be so much bigger than any of them, though, because we've got it all bottled up inside. I yeah, yeah I feel like for sure. <laughs> it's gonna. It's. Ugh, I'm. I'm so happy. Weren't there giant uh, explosions of culture after things like the Great Depression and World yeah, the, War Two? Yeah, the Roaring Twenties. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just, we're gonna have it. Absolutely. We're gonna do it up so big. 
well, this is going to be called the second renaissance. Well, yes. that's a ma- that's one of the ma- Animatrix shorts. Oh, that's true. And they all die in it. I um, mean, the third hey, renaissance. One hundred percent positive. When the vaccine is all out and everyone go back to normal ish, they will call it the Roaring Twenties. There's no way around it. Yeah, there's no way around it. There's no way around it. And we just have to embrace it now and prepare for that being run into the ground. Cosplayers have been working on their crazy ass suits for like a year plus now. So they're going to have wild shit to show off at the next Anime Expo. It's going to be great. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you for going to the show and bringing a friend. And uh, yes. You know, hopefully we can come back to New York and. Yeah, I would again. love if you guys came back to the East Coast. That would be so exciting. I would bring even more people next Definitely. time. Well, the, <laughs> we'll, yeah. we will do it again when the world. We got a street team out here. Out. Yeah, and I, I feel like at the very least we have to do more New York shows. Yeah, that, that yes, was. Please. Uh, <laughs> you know, again, like we did all those other East Coast cities and we had to kind of, you know, uh, some of them sold out pretty quick, but some of them we really did have to advertise, you know, like, hey, does North Carolina know we're coming? You know, we need to get that <laughs> out there. But New York was like that sold out in two seconds. And we, we there was so much more demand that we did not meet. Right. Uh, that was really mind blowing to me. I'm just so saying we, we should do like a bunch of shows. We there. could have sold out the garden, bro. Yeah. Hey, when this thing comes back. Here. Yeah. <laughs> more tours. Yes. Definitely all over. Yeah. Where the demand is. We're gonna I, I want to get back into that. And we're going to do uh, game days at the Jacob Javits Center. <laughs> yeah. I, lo- I love hearing that name. The that works Jacob out well. Javits Center. Do we have any places here that are just a name? Of a dude? Uh, Jack Murphy. No. Yeah. That guy, I, they've all been taken over they by companies. Re- they got rid yeah. of that. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Well. Well. Shit. <laughs> anyway, did, was that everything? Well, was that did all did your... Yeah. Right? Did I don't have one? anything special to say. You can cool. Cool. Well, thank, thank you. you. Well, no, it was a, it was a good reminiscing. Yeah, I I love yeah. about a better <laughs> yes, time. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh my gosh. Well, good times to come. Hopefully for you yes. guys, especially. Um. Yeah. See you guys soon. <laughs> cool. Thank you for your call. Take All care. All right. No problem. Bye. Bye. Johnny, can you zap me out? Okay. Ready. I asked a while ago, Johnny, if you're gonna do him before me, I'm. Okay. Have an issue. One, two, three. This is bullshit. I didn't see if that happened. Am I gone? Okay. Thank you. I didn't see. This is bullshit. I asked first. Uh, I'm looking. Mm. I was looking right now. Yeah. It's how? They can't have. Yeah. How do they survive a pandemic? I mean, lots of places do. Just. Apparently, they're still doing classes. I don't know. Oh. Yeah. They They have like classes there okay i I could see i doing like zoom classes you know most comedians say the last thing you could ever do is learn anything from a comedy class i don't know maybe maybe stage presence or something the old ucb classes were pretty good but i mean yeah improv and stuff yeah there were a lot of a lot of good people that came out of that so i don't know what you guys are talking about i don't like it it's, I think maybe it's because you invited your dad there to come and wreck our whole green room thing. Yeah. Well, that was job was Jersey, New Jersey. Yeah. yeah. No, I like the Jersey green room. That, that was, was when fun. I said hi. Yeah. I said hey, how's it going? And had a great interaction. And then yeah. I was told later that you they wanted, wanted to punch yeah. your face. Punch me in the oh face. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm so sorry. I remember all of the live shows by the green room vibe, and I remember like. A tiny vibe in Philly. It was like tiny upstairs looking over the street vibe. Mm-hmm. D- looking at drunk girls like wiggling down the street mm-hmm. and out through a second floor window. <laughs> and then the vibe in New York's green room was like, yeah, the owners coming in to like get us to plug their thing. Yeah. The vibe at, at uh, Philly was Johnny's dad coming in. New like, Jersey. Hey, or Jersey. Right, right. He was like, hey, you guys ain't smoking dope in here, huh? California's got dope. It's legal, huh? I love talking to the sound guy before the show, and he was like, okay, last laugh. Um, Death is certain. Is, is, are, is this like their final tour? <laughs> like, is this the end of Mega 64? Yeah. And I was like, no, man, we're doing more. He was like, oh, okay. This cool. is the first one. This is a prelude. We're working backwards. Uh, I'm trying to think. The Richmond, Virginia green room was awesome. We had the whole basement. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is gone. 
I know yeah, that that's place sad. Closed. That place is gone. That was my favorite green room of all of them because yeah, we had an underground cave to ourselves with old VHS. Yeah, and there was like dark corners that I was yeah out. Was yeah, cool. and there was shit going on in those dark corners. Yeah. There was like a sewing circle, like cult meeting going on under yeah. the stairs in one of them. But they had uh, a day at Epcot on VHS playing on a TV, and that was my favorite part. I was like, oh, I have to watch it. And then everyone was just like. Yo, there's a million VHS tapes down here. Just take this one. Just take it. Just <laughs> yeah, take it. Yeah. And I couldn't do it. I went to the owner and said, hey. It's the right thing to do. Would you miss it if I took this tape? And he went, huh, I wouldn't miss it. <laughs> yeah, you know, he was just like, hey, just, we got a hundred more. Don't it's the right thing it. to do. So I did, and it's in my office now. And then I took it with me. And then when we were packing stuff up at the end of the tour, I remember Sean or, or somebody, maybe Derek too, we're like, Rocco, you took it. Look what you took. Look, he took that tape. And it was like, I, I talked to <laughs> yes. the owner. I talked to the owner. There was debate about just steal it, steal it, you know. Yeah, but I didn't want to do that. Uh, you know, Epcot I means a lot to people. I didn't want to, you know. In D.C., maybe this is prelude to the incoming Civil War, but I, it was a very smoky green room in D.C., do you remember they burnt a pizza in the oh, oven? Yeah, they burnt pizzas. And yeah. the kitchen just pushed all this smoke into our green room. Yeah, it was like, okay, when are we going on stage? Yeah, it was filled. Uh, but that was a good, that was a decent green room. Nice Didn't couches. Did someone ask if we came out to do our meet and greet like before the show? Yeah. I feel like someone asked me of like, yo, yo, yo you know, were y'all smoking back there or something? I was, like, we, were, we all came out like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're like, oh, he's smoking something. <laughs> and I was like, no, no, they're cooking wood fire pizzas and killing us. <laughs> like, the, I think the ovens were like just down the hall or something yeah. like that. Is the kitchen's like attached yeah. or something. <laughs> we got to do that again. I was really like, that last caller is just reminding me of it all. But yeah, yeah I was going, dude, my life's going to change. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna be touring so much. I'm yeah. gonna have to like change my work schedules yeah. around, yeah, and like yeah. you know, this is gonna be kind of a maybe yeah. I have to you know have a burden on my relationship. I'll be gone so much and all yeah. this stuff. Little did we know your life would change in like such a drastically different way. Yeah, yeah. My, you'd, my you'd be at home every single day after that. <laughs> my relationships <laughs> in in turmoil because I'm around too much now. <laughs> fucking sick of me already. Oh man, yeah. Who would have thunk it? Uh, well, three more calls. Still waiting to get zipped out of here, Johnny. I'm doing the fucking. You got to do a manual thing. zip. You got to do a manual zip. Whoosh! Man, I got I got nowhere to go. I can just. Time is running out. On what? <laughs> oh, come on! Stop. <laughs> I didn't at any point get to. Uh, com um, this is uh, this is a. Uh, 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 the shirt I got from uh, Thank You Cactus Jack, Travis Scott. But uh, I, l I really love having access to all the cast information. Um, if you just want to get down here, um, there's uh, if you want to know who produced the film, that's right there. This was actually all on the back of the shirt, but I didn't. I don't like the. F I didn't like. Um, I actually I wore it back. I. Uh, it. This is actually the front. Don't film this. Can you go to Kevcam and like film the ceiling or something. Can you? I just said film the ceiling. I just like having all the, the cast info, so I turned it around. I didn't really get to explain that earlier. It's by Christopher Nolan? What? Are we still on? Okay. <laughs>